Although power plants may appear complex, the basic processes used to create electricity are surprisingly simple. Let's take a look at how it works. Most power plants generate heat in order to produce steam, which drives turbines that generate electricity. Nuclear fission, natural gas, and coal are the main fuels used in the United States. At Fisk & Crawford, coal is the fuel burned to generate heat. Traditional coal-fired power plants like Fisk & Crawford have two basic components. The first is a furnace boiler designed to burn coal and capture the resulting heat energy using a system of circulating water and steam. The process starts with the boiler, which is a furnace where combustion takes place. Pulverized coal is injected with a stream of air into the furnace in a continuous process through a device known as a burner. Burners ignite the coal and air mixture, creating a maximum amount of heat possible, as much as 1,500 degrees centigrade. The second part of the system is a steam turbine generator, which converts the heat energy captured by the steam into electrical energy. First, the intense boiler heat coming from the furnace turns water running through the pipes around the boiler into steam. The steam travels through more pipes to the turbine, causing it to spin and turn the shaft of the generator, which creates electricity. Another series of pipes allows the steam to cool, condensing back into water heading back to the boiler where the process begins again in a continuous cycle. At Fisk & Crawford, we are proud to provide reliable and affordable power to the people of Chicago.